Both stage, so to say, the same location. We are just calling it as. <coughs> on behalf of the government of Goa, and especially on behalf of our Honorable Chief Minister, it is a privilege, your eminence, to have you here today. Uh, I would be failing in my duties if I if I don't mention here that the church and the government here in Goa have collaborated very well to ensure that this exposition, a decennial exposition which happens once in 10 years, is taken to a different level. We thought the government and the church would work hand in hand and ensure the best of facilities for the devotees who come to 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 venerate our Goin' Society, our St. Francis Xavier, who we formerly know, know as Goin' Society. And we wish all the devotees would go back with a very pleasurable experience and a very blessed experience here in Goa. So once again, I take this opportunity to have you. It's a privilege to have you here amongst us. And I hope you will go back with wonderful memories from Goa. All the best. On behalf of the uh, Archbishop of Jardinia Para, who is the substitute of the Secretary of State, just to help you to understand His Excellency's function that uh, they only see after Pope, then there is Cardinal Secretary of State, and then uh, His Excellency, uh, his important role that the Holy See, uh, who kindly accepted to come over to Kerala on the occasion of the Episcopal ordination. Me that took place on last Sunday, and also on this uh, exceptional occasion of the exposition of the sacred relics of Saint Francis Xavier, um, who came from a very distant place out of love uh, for Christ and also for out of love for the people, uh, he with the with the fire of of uh, sharing the good news, sharing the uh, good values, he came from, uh, from a distant place to here. And uh, for us, it is the, after St. Thomas, he is the second apostle of India. And uh, this is a very uh, sacred moment and very uh, important moment also because the exposition will take place only once. Very ten year, and so um, here we have Monsignor, uh, Monsignor Rolanda Smakriskas. Also, he recently, um, by the Pope Francis, uh, named Cardinal. And um, here, Monsignor Javier, who is who was also collaborating in the Apostolic Ministry at Vatican Embassy at the New uh, uh, at Delhi, New Delhi. Now Rami, who is from Syria, but he is working as the uh, visitator of the Syrian Catholic Church. So it's a uh, very uh, special delegation, and uh, I'd like to thank from the bottom of God for welcoming us and uh, your Excellency Mr. Sandeep for all the uh, hard work and planning behind uh, this exposition your sincere um, efforts to make this a great success. Eight million people is a, it's a population of some country, you know, in small countries. Uh, I was in Costa Rica, it is five million people. So eight million people to manage a pilgrimage is, is a, it's a, it requires a lot of efforts, patience and planning. And thank you for all that you do for this event and all, all others who are part, um, we wish all the best and all the blessings for you and your um, dear ones. And in a special way, we thank the Archbishop Govan Dhamma, Kathleen, Kathleen Farao, and also the Excellency, the Occident Bishop of the Sarsabas, and all the priests, and all the lay men and women who are. Coming these days to make this event very fruitful spiritually, first of all, and also orderly and a success. This is your first visit to Goa. 
and how has your experience been so far? Yes, it's my first time in, uh, in Goa and as uh, His Excellency said, we stayed before in Kerala in his diocese for his Episcopal ordination. Um, I think that <coughs> St. Francis Xavier is uh, one of the biggest missionaries that we have in the church. That uh, in uh, many years ago, he had the courage to come here to preach to these people the gospel and to be Christ present in among the people of Goa. And uh, still now, we realize that uh, the heritage of Francis Xavier is still present and, as Father said, is an example for bishops, for priests, and for the Catholics. But I say also for the entire population, because uh, St. Francis Xavier, he tried to do the best, the best for the people. That is what Jesus Christ teaches us. Uh, Jesus Christ said to us that we have faith, that is the, the most important thing, to love God. But that love to God is an input to love each other. Each other doesn't matter who is, but to love each other. And I think that in this moment, in India, in Asia, in Asia, in, in the world, is still a message. It's a still message, important message for all of us to love each other, to help each other, and to do the best for the other. And this is what uh, bring us here in, in Goa, uh, just to pray in front of the relics, relics of St. Francis, also to ask him the grace and the blessing to continue to do that in the church. Uh, I'm sorry for my voice, but no. <coughs> The change of climate it was uh, uh, create this uh, this uh, situation. Thank you.